Hi, we want to solve for f of x minus 4 in f of x plus 4 equals x squared plus 7x plus 6. That's the solution. We have 4x plus 4. f of x plus 4 equals x squared plus let us by 7x as 6 plus 1x multiplied by x plus 6. So from here we have f of x plus 4 equals x squared plus 6 times x we have 6x plus 1 times x we have x plus 6. So we have f of x plus 4 equals, let's take this x squared plus 4 plus 6x as one factor. So we have x squared plus 6x, then x plus 6 as another factor. So now we have f of x, f of x plus 4 equals, what's the common factor here? We have x. We have multiplied by x plus 6 plus 1 times x plus 6, right? So here we will have f of x plus 4 equals x plus 1, right? Multiply by x plus 6. So then you observe that okay, this is a domain. So we want to make this to do exactly as the domain. And to do that, we are going to have x plus 4 minus 3 multiplied by x plus 4 plus 2. So therefore, we are going to have Okay, before that, let's our domain x plus 4. Let's change this to x. So we'll have f of x equals x minus 3, then x plus 2. Right? So we'll have x change to x minus 4. So, because we want to get f of x minus 4, right? So, this will be f of x minus 4 equals x minus 4 minus 3, right? So, then x minus 4 minus 2. So, we'll have f of x minus 4. x minus 7 multiplied by x minus 2. So we have x times x, we have x squared. Then x times minus 2, that is minus 2x. Minus 7 times x, that is minus 7x. Minus 7 times minus 2, that is plus 14. So we have f of x minus 4 equals x squared minus 2x minus 7 that is minus 9x plus 14. This is our answer. But let's try another method and see which one works perfectly. So let's say we want to try method 2. We have f of x plus 4 equals x squared plus 7x plus 6, right? So we have, we want to solve for f of x minus 4. So here we have x minus 8 plus 4. That is what becomes x minus 4. We want to find right. So now, Let's obtain 
x squared, then obtain 7x, then we had it with 6. So our x, x squared will be x minus 8 squared, right? Because if we transfer this one here, we are going to have our x becomes x plus x minus 8. So this will become x minus 8 times x minus 8. Expand this, we are going to have x times x, we have x squared. X times minus 8, that is minus 8x. Then minus 8 times x, we have minus 8x. Minus 8 times minus 8, so we have plus 64. So now we have x square equals x square, right? Minus 8x minus 8x, we have minus 16x plus 64, right? Also for 7x, for 7x, we are going to have 7 times x minus 8 so which is equals 7 times x so that is 7x 7 times minus 8 that is minus 56 right so here we will now have f of x minus 4 right equals x square we want to add up everything minus 16x plus 64 plus 7x minus 56 plus 6 right so now we have f of x minus 4 equals x square so we have minus 16x plus 7x right so then we have plus 64 minus 56 plus 6 therefore we have f of x minus 4 equals x square minus 16x plus 7x will give us minus 9x then 64 minus 56 that will give us 64 minus 56 plus 6 that will give us plus 14. so looking at this you see that we obtain the same answer as the first method so which means that our f of x minus 4 equals x square minus 9x plus 14. thank you for watching i hope you enjoyed this video can you like and leave a comment and don't forget to share with your friends and network do well to also subscribe to my channel to stay updated on my next video bye